Alright everyone, this is Kevin the Retro Game Crusader and today we're going on a photography trip around the northeast and we're going game hunting. Yeah. We're gonna see how it goes. I stopped off at my dad's and he had a ton and megaton of like Amiga games and he showed us his two spectrums. That looked kinda cool. Most of his games don't work but I like the whole box art of Street Fighter 2 so I'm keeping that. But we're around the area where I was brought up pretty much on the local transport. And Kev's talking really loud. Yep. <laughs> but we'll do a couple of clips, this add them all together, see how it goes. Say bye for a minute. Bye. Alright everyone, this is Kevin and I'm in Sunderland. Uh, see if I can show anything. Place looks like a dump. Gonna try find some ducks. We can see some ducks. They go quack quack. But uh, we're gonna see if we can find some games. And I'm gonna try to take some photos in a bit. Alright, this is um, CEX, if you can see. <laughs> this place has got a lot of games, and we're gonna go have a look. Right, first of all, I picked up. Link's passport training for a pound fifty. I'm not sure exactly if it's rare or not, but I don't really see it that many places and looks like it could be pretty much fun. And the next game I know is quite rare, but it's on, it's on multiple, multiple platforms. Spire of the Dragon. A new beginning. I think it was like a reboot of the whole series. But we'll have a look later.